Okay, the first thing I wanted to do is take a look at this link that, uh, down in the description. Uh, and by the way, hold on at the end of my little <laughs> rant here. Uh, I got a great video that describes more of the details of this program. But there's a program that gives out $200,000 you know, uh, to first time home buyers in Washington, D.C. Now that's right, it's showing you, you have to look locally for programs like this. They're not gonna jump out and sit in your lap, jump in your pocket either. Uh, and you won't find them in Google because Google's all about people who wanna make money from you. So the real estate agents, the people selling money or whatever, they don't even know about these grants. Well, they may, but they, oh yeah, I heard about the grants, but there's no more, you know, and that's why you'll have to use this to buy the house so I get a commission. <laughs> so don't do that until you really have to. You got to find all the grants that are out there to help you buy a house. Okay. I put another link in the, in the description and below. Uh, that shows you eight places in every city that will help you for free find grants to buy a house, particularly if you're low to middle income people. Well, that's actually, they'll do it for anybody. <laughs> and they're all free. These are government organizations and nonprofit organizations that help people get houses, okay? That's what's it. It's the most important thing probably in our country right now, besides not going to war. <laughs> and so they're there sitting to, for, to help you. And you don't have to pay them anything to do this. Uh, they already got paid. So if you go to Google, everybody wants to get paid by you. So they want to sell you something because they got to pay Google. Stay away from Google. Don't Google it. Okay, so down, go down to the link uh, in the description. Get this list and start contacting. They're not going to contact you. You got to call them, okay? And then you have to be polite, be nice, ask them for help. If they can't help you, ask them who else can help you. That's the way you do research in this country. Okay, the next thing you could do uh, for free and not use Google is go to chat.openai.com. Now, this is interesting. I went in and, and I'll put this link in the description below too. And I asked chat, <laughs> show me 30 grants, um, actually it only showed me 18, and for low and middle income home buyers uh, in the state of New York with websites, okay? Yeah, they're all good stuff. Home buyer dream program, up to $19,500 grant for down payment and, and up to $500 cost of, of uh, home ownership courses. <laughs> they pay you for that. Uh, Federal Home Loan Bank Board has programs uh, for people who earn only 80% of the median income. They have down payment money. Another one, mobile and manufactured home replacement program. These are all grant programs. The state of New York, uh, community development and block grants have that. Look at it, it goes on and on and on and all the links are there, okay? That's down in the bottom, okay? So you have all these places to check before you talk to anybody who wants to sell you something, okay? Don't do that, please, <laughs> okay? <laughs> and and uh, look at the video, okay? Uh, and then what we do at Let's Go Help, uh, we answer any questions you have about getting free money to do anything in your life. That's what we do. And we give out uh, grants ourselves. We give out over $70,000 uh, every month. I think we've given about $3,000. 3,000 uh, members have gotten grants from us now. Wow. We've only been doing it for about a year or so. <laughs> That's about half our membership. <laughs> so make sure uh, you let us help you get a grant from us, but we charge. It's $20. Uh, but look at this video. It's all about that $200,000 grant. <laughs> Have you ever reached into the cookie jar only to find it's empty? Well, that's what's happening with DC's Home Buyer Assistance Fund. But don't despair, picket fence dreamers. This is just a tiny hiccup. Now imagine a superhero, cape flowing in the wind, labeled HPAP Man. He's here to save the day, announcing a boost in the Home Purchase Assistance Program funds from a modest 80,000 to a staggering 200,000. But remember, even superheroes need their beauty sleep. So the program is taking a short nap until October. Picture a lender named Alexis Vining, surrounded by empty piggy banks, dramatically declaring that in her 17-year career, she's never seen the piggy banks so hollow. But fear not, the mayor's out there playing pirate on a treasure hunt for more gold coins to fill those banks. Keep in mind, home buyers, just like the weather, assistance programs change. Time to put on your detective hats and start exploring. Each city has its own treasure chest of programs waiting to be discovered. Who knows? The key to your dream home might be in the next chest you open. So keep dreaming, keep searching, and make sure you stay tuned for more updates. Because you never know when you might stumble upon your own pot of gold. 
or should I say a house-shaped cookie jar filled to the brim.